<laughs> now you guys see why this is a game that needs to be played. Oh my god. <laughs> What's up, agents? Zero here. Welcome to Conquer's Bad Fur Day, and it's for mature audiences only. So, I do want to talk about that a little bit later. I do want to kind of introduce this game just a little bit. So, this was made during the N64 days, which I personally did not own an N64 when I was younger, but it was a pretty impressive system back then. And hold on. Conquer! Conquer, please! We haven't even gotten into any of the menus. Calm down, my gosh. That's better. No, it is not. Freaking destroyed the Nintendo 64 logo. Okay, anyway, so this is a game from the N64 library that pretty much everybody, I feel, needs to play at least at some point. And also, um, the name of this, uh, bar that, uh, Conquer's designed to go into. That's, um, there's some sort of reference I've heard. I don't know what that reference technically is. Alright, so. Oh, yeah, um, uh, look above the fireplace. That's Banjo Kazooie's head. He was also pretty popular back on the N64 as well. Alright, so. I want to go ahead and discuss briefly about this game. So, as you saw at the beginning, it said for mature audiences only, so. This will technically break my personal rule of making my videos family friendly. However, I'm willing to put that aside for the sake of this game because this is an absolutely hilarious game. If you have never seen this game before, you're going to see exactly what I'm talking about. There is going to be some crudeness and things like that that will appear in the game. I am not going to censor any of it just for the sake of entertainment, but my commentary will not include any of that whatsoever, so take that how you will. And I have technically been playing this just a, uh, quite a bit, oh my gosh, I didn't even realize. I've almost got seven hours in this game. This game is not a short game by any means. And I'm somewhat new to this game, technically speaking. This technically is my first ever playthrough. However, I'm actually going to be starting a completely brand new file. One thing I do want to mention is, if we go ahead and go into the options menu, we can go ahead and enter cheat codes, and I'm not going to show this off right now, but supposedly, I have not tested this just yet, but supposedly, you can enter swear words into the cheat codes, and you will get some sort of response from whoever the heck this guy technically is. I have no idea. Okay. And also, yeah, actually, I don't think there's really anything else for me to go ahead and discuss. There is a multiplayer option, which unfortunately with the emulator that I'm playing on right now, not technically possible, just simply because of the device I'm playing on. But regardless, let's go ahead and start off a new game. So we're going to get started, and there's going to be quite a bit of cutscenes that we're going to have to go through, and I will try my best to not speak over what I can. Right, so it does say Nintendo Presents. I'm surprised this is a game that was produced on a Nintendo console back when it was released. So this was made by Rareware, as we saw um, uh, Conquer go ahead and replace the logo for. <laughs> okay, so it says starring Conquer and Barry. And already we're starting off to a uh, strong... Um, Start. That was a weird way to put it, but regardless. Hey there, Conqueror. I'm gonna go ahead and turn the volume down just a little bit. Alright, so we got Conqueror on a throne. Should have some dialogue relatively soon. And there's voice acting in this game as well, by the way. As you heard from the intro before. I mean, come on. This is taking way too long, but it's a really interesting game regardless. Got your milk, dude. Come on, start the story, please. Come on. Yes, this is gonna take a bit of time, and mainly. Well, 
There I am. Conquer the king. King of all the land. Oh, yeah. Who'd have thought that? <laughs> but how did I come to this? I hear you say. And who are those strange fellows that surround my throne? I hear you also say. Well, it's a long story. It is. Come closer, and I'll tell you. I mean, further away from you, dude. It all started yesterday, yesterday apparently. What a day that was. <laughs> yeah. It's what I call a bad fur day. So there we go. There's the title screen. Cocker's Bad Fur Day. And as I said, this is a pretty interesting game. Something, like I said, pretty much everyone needs to play at least once. Technically speaking, I'm going through this twice. Once for you guys, once for myself. Ooh, so we got dancing. Oh my gosh, could you not? Stand straight up, please. We don't need um, a better look at that. Okay. I'm not available to answer the phone, obviously. Yeah. However, if you leave your like name and number, I sound cute. May <laughs> Thank you. Ciao. Alright. Hi, Barry. Hello. Barry, you better pick up. Hello. <laughs> Background noise, my gosh. Oh, anyway, look. I'm gonna be a bit late. So I'll met up with a couple of the guys and they're off tomorrow to some I don't know, fight some war or something. I don't think so. Anyway, um I'll see ya. L love you. Okay, so Conker loves this girl apparently. I think she bought it. <laughs> Conker! Put the phone down. Oh, oh right. Who's round with it? Yours. What again? Oh my gosh. Okay. Someone lend me a fiver. <laughs> Someone lend me a fiver. Wow. All right. That uh, a... uh, Amazing. I don't feel so good now. Yeah. You, you look guys good. enjoy yourself and all that, and I'll probably see you sometime next week. I gotta go home. Oh my gosh. Um, oh I'll wow, that is right. oh, not pleasant oh, to look at. No, that's the toilets. Uh, if you're yeah. not feeling good, maybe the po toilets might be a better option, dude. Let's see. I know what's going on. No, it doesn't. Conquer. Conquer. Are you. Please don't. Please don't. He was going to anyway. Disgusting. Then again, his current state, I don't. Blame him. Yeah, I bet you are. Yeah, Conker's not in a good place right now. Stand up straight, you fool. I know it's hard. Oh my gosh. Now what? Mainly there's a lot of cutscenes that I have to go through. I will say that much. I get that's a bit annoying, but it helps to get through the storyline a little uh, bit. Can't quite make it out. Anyway, can, really? Seems pretty familiar to me. I don't think so. So you have the option of going either nasty or nice. I'm not sure. That's neither of those options, you idiot. Okay. Now I think this should be the second to last cutscene before we actually get into actual gameplay. Again, I'm going to say this one final time. There's a lot of cutscenes to have to go through here. But it tells such an interesting and hilarious story, we'll say that much. What you got there, dude? Milk? You got milk. More milk? Saya? Alright, I still have yet to figure out who this guy is even supposed to be in my other playthrough, I will say that much, my private playthrough. Yeah, go on and wipe that mustache. Milk mustache. Ooh, uh oh. Well, oh, any good? Yeah, swallow hard. Be afraid. I still know who this guy is, but he's no joke. You encounter him yet? Okay. 
Yeah, your anger, I get, I get. Just stop. Okay. So it seems like we've got Conqueror's side of the story and whatever he <laughs> technically is, whoever he is. Yeah, things are not looking good for you, Conqueror. I will say that much. Go ahead, cough it up. What you got? It's gonna be one of those days. Yeah. It, yeah, I know. I know you're not feeling too good right now, Conker. I get that. Alright. So now we're currently inside of the game, and before we go any further, he is not gonna be like this the entire game. If you have never seen this game before, which I can't imagine how many of you are watching that haven't seen this game before, yeah, he's not gonna be like this all the time. He is, at the very least, going to sober up relatively quickly. We just have to unlock the specific part where that ends up happening, which is actually around this area. And something I haven't actually mentioned just yet, because this was on the old N64, it actually only had one joystick, so I had to map my second joystick to it, and something worth mentioning, I'm going to show this off. Okay, so this isn't really showing up too well because the camera is actually inverted, but the actual control, actually, I think I might be able to show this off a little bit better. So, down, okay, up, actually, yeah, this is not going to be easy to show off. But yeah, the controls are inverted, and there's no way that I could find to change that. Which is going to be a bit annoying, so in case the camera, like, goes in random directions while I'm playing this, I apologize, so you're going to have to pardon me for that. Oh my gosh, who do we have here? I'm Conker. Oh, uh, hello. Can you help me? I, I need to get home and go to bed, because I don't feel very well at all. You don't all. look very good, Conker, dude. <laughs> No, you're not gonna help him go home? Oh, so you can't help me at all? No. Nope. Uh, uh, actually, uh, yeah. Yeah, I guess I can. You can help you a little bit. Um, okay. What's your name? Yeah, what is your Beardy. name? Birdie. Birdie? Beardy? You haven't got a beard. <laughs> no. Birdie. Let's get Birdie's. Okay. Okay, Birdie. Okay. Um, so how you, can you help me? Right. <laughs> Okay. By the way, this game is going to have, like, a lot of... Well, actually, I shouldn't say a lot, but it has quite a few fourth wall breaks. This game is absolutely insane, I won't say that much. Stand on here. You see those buttons? Yep. Context sensitive. And, uh... Well, actually, the, uh, uh, press B. Press B. Yeah. Oh, yeah. The light comes on. Uh, and it makes a nice ting. Ting noise. <laughs> press ting. Uh, no, ting. I'm... Press I wouldn't be surprised. Yeah. Okay, I'll press B. I wouldn't be surprised if this guy is, um... In pretty much the exact same position that Conker is in right now. Okay, so we need to go ahead and press B here. No, Conker, you don't need more. Oh, never mind. Okay. Well, if he wasn't before, he's going to be soon, I imagine. Uh, what does that mean? Yeah. It means contact sensitive. You're not helpful. To contact that is one of the biggest does. I've ever seen in games. Then again, even I'm confused on what it means. Or I could try it again. Actually, um... What the... What on earth? <laughs> oh my... Conker, how on earth did you have that in your pocket? I'm confused. Are you giving him another? Does it... You don't need more, neither does he. I'm gonna go to bed now. Where are you gonna go to bed at? Is that it? Can I do any more? 
No, I can't. Okay. So, let's see. The gate that I need to go through, where on earth is it? Oh, it's right there. Apparently not. Um, right there. There it is. Okay. So, go ahead and stand on here and we'll do the same thing again. Something to drink. Oh, just what I needed. In fact, it would seem to me that these give me just what I need at that moment in time. Oh, I see what he means. Context sensitive. Okay. Clever. Oh, yeah. I feel loads better. Right. Yep. Let's get out of here. Yeah, you def oh, by the way, if for whatever reason you want to skip all these wonderful cuts, which I probably then just press the L button. But you will have to have watched them at least once. Right. And I may potentially do that during the course of these videos. If I decide to actually go ahead and do a full-on series, I can't guarantee that I will. But if there's a pretty annoying thing that I have to go through over and over again, then I definitely will. But obviously, as he said, I can't skip them unless I've already done it. So is there anything more I can do here? Um... No. Wait, hold on. What if I were to try to attack him? Can, does that do anything? <laughs> I don't know if you guys heard that. Okay, so apparently he says it over and over again. Okay, fine. So let's see. We can get in the water. Going across, just like this. Come on, get across, Conker. There you go, bud. Oh, I can't seem to get any further. I'm sure there was something. I imagine there is. Come on, Skip. Ah, uh, yeah, now I remember. Hold the Z button down, and I should crack. Right, got it. Now then, what was it? Oh, yeah. Press, Press A to jump extra high. I mean, I know this is a bit annoying. A again to do that funny helicopter tail thing. Now that makes me harder. Hmm. I should easily get across that gap. Yeah, you definitely should. Um, are you sure you got that? Yeah, I got it, dude. I got it. I realize it's a bit annoying, but remember, this is back in the N64 days where video games, at least 3D video games, were... Well, somewhat common, from what I understand, this was basically published near the end of the N64's life cycle, so people a lot more used to it back then. But regardless, okay, so let's go ahead and test this. If I jump up, that's how, um, it would be helpful if I could get a sense of perspective. So if I go ahead and jump up, oh, that's, um, not the one I meant to press. Okay, so... I go ahead and jump up like this. So that's how high I jump there. If I go and crouch now. So I definitely do jump a bit higher. I apologize for pressing the wrong button. I was going to actually map the B button to the actual B button. But that's what the B button actually does. Not that it really matters. Right, so I should hopefully be able to get across to here. There we go. Alright, so let's go ahead and glide across here. So, go ahead and do this, and there's a door right here which you can't enter because it's closed. Alright, so let's go ahead and go across to here. There we go, just barely made it. Okay, so, yeah, alright. I'm pretty sure this gap I can just, yeah, do that. Okay, gotcha. Lever right here, let's see. I know exactly what this does. Let's pull this lever. Opens up that door. Okay. So let's go ahead and go back over there and do whatever it is that's actually in there. Be careful not to fall off. That would be not fun to have to deal with. I will go ahead and say that I know I'm not going to die i will say that much at least not now because this is technically the tutorial okay so we're locked in 
So now I need to try and get this guy to unlock the door. Hang on. There's something missing here. Didn't I have a... Ah. Nah. Try pressing B and see what that does. Gotcha. Um, are you sure you've got that? Yes, Conker, I got that. Question is, do you got that? That's the big question here. Ooh, I got him. First try. Okay. Go ahead and pick you up. Nope, never mind. I um, apparently missed. Gotcha. By the way, this is not very easy to do. I have had so many issues with that. Before. Go ahead, put that key in there, Conker. Just stick the whole key right in there, why don't you? Okay. So, let's see. Let's go ahead and... There we go. Took long enough to load. Wow. Okay. Let's see. Rotate the camera just a little bit. Is this going to be... Yep, that's enough. Okay, so I don't need to crouch and jump in order to do that. Good to know. Alright, so let's go ahead and go back across here. There we go. Go across this bridge with there's someone blocking the way. That's... Okay. Who's this guy? Yeah, who is he? If you think you're coming this way, you can think again. Yeah. Oh, you're a real charmer. We need to get through, I dude. I just want to get past, please. No. Please. I don't think so. You need, we need to. I've only just got comfy. Have you ever sat on a piece of gothic architecture for 200 years? Can't say I have. Gets right up your ass. <laughs> Thought it was about time to move on to a bridge, say. And I'm not moving now. Isn't it a little bit early in the day to start talking about gothic architecture? That's the least of your well, worries, dude. If you care to come a bit closer, we can discuss things of another nature. I'm not sure I like the idea of that, but it doesn't look like I have a much other choice. Bang. <laughs> the frying pan. Yeah. <laughs> you stupid little... You did that to yourself. I mean, I did smack you. That's not the point. Goodbye. And hello to that. Alright. Well, at least he's gone, which is helpful. But this is now here, which is not helpful. Okay. We need to go ahead and jump up here. There we go. And I think, if I'm not mistaken, yeah, I need to go over there. Okay, so I can zoom in. Yeah, I do need to go over there. What's the best angle? Because I want to just gun it. Run and gun it. That's probably not the right word because there's no guns in this game as far as I'm aware. All right, context sensitive. Right, not going to repeat that because that's a was an annoying thing to begin with. Plunger with dynamite. You going to blow it? Um, I think I know what's going to happen now. Okay, and... There we go. Yep. Fantastic. Alright. Let's go and get some shut eye. Yeah, I don't think that's gonna end up happening, Conqueror, sadly. Considering the fact that this is a massive game for what well, was back then. Oh my gosh, I almost fell down. Yeah, you're not getting shy for quite some time, dude. This is gonna be annoying. And I think I have to go through yeah, another Cutscene. I don't know if you got anything. That's a good question. Yeah, I think we know what he's like at this point. Yeah. I think he's a kind of interesting character. I'm not 100% sure if I like him, though. He's kind of funny later on, I will say that much. Alright. Make your statement, dude. Professor. Yep. Welcome. I have a job. Classic for villain you. speaking slowly. As you can see. The table. Yeah, there's a problem with the table. I will say that much. No, it's not good, Let dude. We have a look at this file. How can you not tell what the prop I think I see the problem? Took you that long? Oh my gosh, it voice cracked. Moment. Don't be too 
Oh my gosh, dude, you need a, you need a team uh, fix. Last time. I'll go now. I don't want to have to get the dog tape out again. <laughs> again? <laughs> yes. Wait, no. And, uh, I don't want to I don't even want to know. I don't. I don't even want to know. Oh my gosh, this is bizarre. I'll get him a duck tape. Oh my god. I'll come down here. I'll show him what the duck tape is. I'll show him what the stuff is. Interesting. <laughs> now you guys see why this is a game that needs to be played. Oh my god. This is hilarious. Alright. So, Conker's in front of some chocolate. Alright, so let's go ahead and pick this up. And this is something I do want to go and mention. This is, technically speaking, Conker's health. I don't even understand. I'm pretty sure chocolate's not supposed to cure hangovers, but that's not the point. Okay, so... With that out of the way, this is actually where I'm going to end off this first episode. And this is boring that I decide to play more. Hold on. You are reading. What on earth are you reading, dude? What on earth were you even reading? Do I even want to know? I don't think I want to. By the way, um, something I want to mention, this is not really going to be important to gameplay, but Conker has a bunch of, like, idle animations, one of which he actually happens to have a Game Boy, which, one of the old Game Boys, I think it's a Game Boy Color, I'm not 100% sure, that's not the point. But yeah, this is actually where I'm going to end off this episode, and this is barring you guys want to see more of this game. But yeah, so, yeah, well, there's more remaining things also. Hopefully you guys have enjoyed. If you did, make sure that like button. One more than make sure that subscribe button for future content. Also, you can follow me on Twitter at AgentCPU0 to stay updated. This has been Zero Studios. Thank you guys for watching. And with that, I'll see you guys later. <laughs>